welcome back to Teach Me Tuesday. So we did a Brito inspired painting. This one is done by a wonderful five year old and this one I have been working on. Um, what we're going to do to tie up the last things is uh, just do a little outlining. So join me and come and look at our final product. Okay, so I got um, kind of a round brush, long, that can make some nice long lines. And I've diluted my paint a little bit. When I put water in the paint, it just goes on more smooth. So you don't have such a blobby paint. Now, uh, what we're going to do is we, we're going to tighten up how we started off the pattern. So just simply outlining the painting so it just becomes bold and crisp colors and edges. If you don't care for too bold, you can bold edges, you don't have to do this. So I decided to leave like the big, the smaller patterns alone because if it, get, it can easily become too much black. So sometimes it's just nice to have that like that. If um, there's always more you can do with paintings, if you don't like the color combinations that you're not sure if you want, you can always change it with your paint by painting over it. I might want to just put a little bit of that polka dot here. If this is not a happy painting, I don't know. Thank you for joining me and uh, see you next week.